guys, welcome back to our channel. My name is Andrea with Foodimentary Adventures in Food, and I am here today with a retro peanut butter cookie recipe from Bisquick. I love cookbooks and I collect them. I have this vintage cookbook from the 1960s, and I saw a peanut butter cookie recipe that I'd never seen before, so I wanted to try it out with you guys today. So you are going to need your Bisquick mix. You're gonna need some water. You're gonna need some brown sugar, some white sugar, some peanut butter. And then you're also going to need some butter or shortening. Now the original recipe called for shortening. I don't have any shortening, um, but I know that butter is a substitute for that. So I have some butter right here. And I will make sure to leave the recipe in the description box. So if you wanna see how these cookies turn out, stay tuned. So I have my bowl here and I am going to drop in my brown sugar and my white sugar, my butter, and my peanut butter. and my water. And now I'm going to add in my baking mix. So here is my dough all mixed up and it smells really, really good. I've got my pan right here. So all I'm going to do is just roll up probably like a, an inch of cookie dough, just like that. There it is, make little rounds. And I've got my oven preheated to 350 degrees. So I'm just gonna do a few of these on camera and then I'll do the rest off camera. And I'll just do one more. I'm just gonna drop it down. And then what I do is I have a little bitty bowl of water and I have a fork and all I do is wet my fork so that it won't stick to the dough and I just do the traditional crisscrosses. So I just go down, 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 and then I go across, across, just like that. Down, 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 and then across, across. Just like that, okay. I'm gonna do the rest and then I will show you what they look like. So I have one pan ready to go and then I've got another one almost ready to go. The instructions say to pop these in the oven for eight to 10 minutes. So I am going to throw these in the oven and then I will show you what they look like when they come out. So both batches of cookies are out of the oven. I ended up baking these for 13 to 14 minutes each. And as you can see, there's cookies missing from each cookie sheet because Howard and I tried them. That's my husband. And we both really like them a lot. Yeah, so I don't usually like peanut butter cookies. Yeah, he's not a peanut butter cookie person, but these are really, really good. So Howard, will you break one open so people can see what they look like? So there they are. It's a, let me try to focus. It's a very tender cookie. And Howard's, you like soft cookies. Yes. And I'm into crunchy cookies, and these satisfy both of us. They're not too soft, they're not too crunchy. And I definitely think this will be my go-to peanut butter cookie from here on out. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure to give us a thumbs up. We do recipes, taste tests, grocery hauls, and what's for dinner, and we'd love for you to be part of our YouTube family. Thanks so much for watching, and we'll see you guys next time.